Angono, pronounced a diaresis oath note, or a diaresis oath note, officially the municipality of Angono, Tagalog, Bayan ng Angono, is a first-class municipality in the province of Rizal, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 113,283 people, located 30 kilometers 19 miles east of Manila, and with the continuous expansion of the metropolis, it is now considered part of Metro Manila's conurbation. It is best known as the Art Capital of the Philippines, being the hometown of national artist for music Lucio San Pedro and national artist for visual arts Carlos Botong. Francisco, as well as the site of the Angono Petroglyphs, the oldest known work of art in the Philippines. It is currently campaigning for its inclusion in the UNESCO Creative Cities Network as it is a center for visual arts. It is also campaigning for the inclusion of the Angono Petroglyphs, one of five properties of the petroglyphs and petrographs of the Philippines UNESCO tentative site, in the World Heritage List. First created as a pueblo in 1766, Angono was a barrio of its neighboring town Taytay and Binangonan before it was legally proclaimed an independent municipality in 1938 by then-President Manuel L. Quezon. Barangays Angono is politically subdivided into 11 barangays Bagambayan Mahabang Parang Poblacion Ibaba Poblacion Itaz, the least populous barangay with 583 persons San Isidro, the most populous barangay with 31,339 persons Santo Niño San Pedro San Roque San Vicente Calayan Demographics In the 2015 census, the population of Angono, Rizal, was 113,283 people, with a density of 4,300 inhabitants per square kilometer or 11,000 inhabitants per square mile. Local government Mayor, Gerardo V. Calderon, MPA, NPC Vice Mayor, ENGR. Antonio Rubin, NPC. Councilors, Jeremy Calderon, NPC. Joe Ann Sagwinson, NPC. Janubar Tiamson, NPC. Sherwin Lagaya, NP. Armando Villamayor, LP. Brian Cruz, LP. Giniclam Miranda, NPC. Patnub A. Tiamson, NP, ABC President, PB Jonathan Hernandez, SK Federation President, Bernard Josel, BJ Tolitz. Forbes. Mayors. Economy. There are several business establishments present in the booming town of Angono. The SM Center Angono is considered as one of the major businesses in town. Trade and commerce are active, such data processing, pawn shops and banks as well. With nearly 100,000 inhabitants in this urbanized town, progress is at its peak. The proposed Angono fish port to be constructed at the lakeside shore of Laguna de Bay will soon boost more business opportunities and easier access from the nearby towns situated at the shores of the said lake. Angono is known as the arts capital of the Philippines. With the existence of numerous business establishments and leisure hubs, historical sites, this town is surely a tourist destination. Culture Angono is the hometown of two national artists, Lucio San Pedro for music and Carlos Botong Francisco for visual arts, one of the public schools in Brigi. Mahabang Parang is named Carlos Botong B. Francisco National High School in honor of the said artist. The town also boasts of other artists like Nemi Miranda known as Nemiranda, Pertagone Bocolan, Jose Pitoc, Blanco and the Blanco family. 
Around the town are artworks like various sculptures. Angono also boasts of several actors, actresses Joey E. Polito, Freddie Reynoso, Zoraida Sanchez, Mike Tan, Nikki Gill, and B.J. Forbes, news anchor Sandra Aguinaldo and film director Kathy Garcia Molina. The artistic town of Angono celebrates the feast of Pope St. Clement I every November 22nd to 23 of each year. There are times that this coincides with the Feast of Christ the King. The celebration starts with the Novena Mass on the 14th till 22nd day of November. The devotees in prayer and thanksgiving, dance in the church patio after the Novena Mass. The dancing was accompanied by the Angono band with the church bell ringing after playing the music. The town is currently campaigning for its inclusion in the UNESCO Creative Cities Network as it is a center for visual arts. It is also campaigning for the inclusion of the Angono Petroglyphs, one of five properties of the Petroglyphs and Petrographs of the Philippines UNESCO Tentative Site, in the World Heritage List. Bispers Mayores The Bispers Mayores or the day before the feast day was celebrated with a parade of the marching bands and drum and lyres sponsored by each barangay of Angono. This was held in the morning and early afternoon. The morning parade usually starts in Rainbow Village and ends at the church patio where the devotees again dances in praise and thanksgiving while the marching bands are playing. The afternoon parade are also joined by the Higantes, local government officials and employees, commercial establishments in Angono, schools and other Angono socio and civic groups. The celebration on the morning of November 23 starts with a concelebrated mass with the Bishop of Antipolo. The procession follows after the Mass with the Pariadoras, Gigantes and devotees joining the image of San Isidro, Saint Clement and Blessed Virgin Mary in a procession leading to the banks of Laguna de Bay in Brigi. San Vicente for the fluvial procession, fishes like Canduli, Tilapia and Bangus which are caught by the fishermen devotees during the fluvial procession are displayed near the image of Saint Clement. The images, devotees and member of the band ride the pagoda for the procession in the lake which will end at the other side of the lake in Brigi. Poblacion Ibaba. The road procession again will start with merry making of pariadoras, gigantes and wet devotees that will end in the church. Filipino artistry is truly alive in every celebration in Angono. Viva Cristo Rey. The Feast of Christ the King which was held on the Sunday before the first Sunday of Advent usually coincides with the Feast of St. Clement. The Viva San Clemente, celebration banners usually includes, Mabuhe Ang Christong Hari, slogans to remind the people that Christ is the Lord and to proclaim Christ as the King of all nations. This is also a reminder that St. Clement is only a servant of God which somehow does not need adoration of the people because our Lord has already given him the highest honor, a blessing of a St. Angono's patron and inspiration. Viva San Clemente Pope St. Clement I was the fourth pope after St. Peter. He faithfully proclaimed Christ during his time until he was martyred by being thrown into the sea with an iron anchor. The people of Angono celebrate St. Clement's Feast Day with a fluvial procession in the waters of Laguna de Bay as a reminder and inspiration of his faith in God. Gigantes Festival Angono's joyous fiesta in honor of San Clemente whose image, resplendent in papal investment, is held November 22-23, and involves a procession accompanied by Pariadora's devotees dressed in colorful local costumes, wooden shoes and carrying boat paddles and gigantes, giant paper match effigies. The street event culminates in fluvial procession at the Laguna de Bay amidst revelry that continues until the image is brought back to its sanctuary. Gigantes Festival is now promoted as tourism generating event in the country. This attracts numerous tourists from all over the world. It was said that the Gigantes started during the Spanish colonial times. It was borrowed to Campong of Binangonan, when Angono was once a hacienda and ruled by Spanish hacienderos the Guido. The Angono land tillers' way of protesting their struggle is by making giant effigy of their landlords whose hands are usually high up on their waist. The body of the traditional higanti are made of bamboo and colorful cloth and its face is of paper match. The three old higantes of Angono consists of the family of giants, the father, mother and child higanti, they traditionally add color and fun during the fiesta celebration. 
It was in the 80s when then Angono artist Pertagon Bocolan brought the idea of the Gigantes Festival by going out of the traditional family of giants and advocating having more Gigantes in the fiesta by coordinating with the barangays of Angono to come up with Gigantes that will represent their barangay. At present, the Gigantes of Angono can be seen in fiesta celebrations around the Philippines and in national cultural presentations, the major being the Centennial Parade in the Quirino Grandstand for the Philippine Centennial Celebration in 1998. The Gigantes are made of paper match. Gigantes measures 4 to 5 feet in diameter and 10 to 12 feet in height. Traditionally, it began in the last century when Angono was a Spanish hacienda. This gigantes was influenced by the Mexican art form of paper match brought by the Spanish priests to the Philippines. Pariadora The traditional pariadoras are group of young girls holding paddles and wearing bakya or wooden slippers and dressed in a colorful outfit which joins the procession in the feast day of St. Clement. They usually march at the beat of the band playing alongside with them. Now with a dying lake, the tradition of the Pariadora is now just a reminder that Angono was once a fishing village and thrives at the harvest of Laguna Lake. Salubong Black Saturday is highlighted by three-hour presentation of Vigilia na Moling Pagkabuhe, at the patio of the church. On Easter Sunday, a celebration is held of the reunion of the risen Christ with Virgin Mary is reenacted. It is facilitated by young girl inside an inverted giant paper flower suspended the removal of the morning veil from Mary's head by a from bamboo trellis. The petals are mechanically opened by giant toy birds to reveal the girl inside. It is then followed by a religious dancing of young ladies called Capitana and Tenyantha, to the tune of Batty. Religion Roman Catholic, Islam, Iglesia ni Cristo, Members Church of God International Born Again, Jehovah's Witness and more. Educational institutions Private schools ALC High School Angono Christian School Angono National High School Angono Private High School Baby Jesus Crisamor Learning Center Blanco Family Academy Caris Praise Christian Academy Christ the King College of Angono Colegio de San Clemente Crossmount School of Arts and Trades Eastern Light College Fadaragas Learning Center Ginger Grace Academe Holy Deliverance Integrated Christian School Hope Academy Jason Harvey Academy Joyland Playschool Child Care and Learning Center Lakeside Hills Learning School Little Footprints Playschool and Tutorial Center Little Lambs Learning Center Maranatha Christian Academy Mary of Light School Mind Slot Integrated School New Hope in Faith School Praise Christian Academy Raises Academy Seven Angels College Shinnel Christian Academy St. Catherine Learning Center St. Martin Montessori School Sto. Antiero Learning Center Health Institutions Angono Medical Hospital St. Clement Medical, Inc. Rizal Provincial Hospital Catholic Church St. Clement Parish, Brgy. Poblacion Ibaba. See also List of cultural properties of the Philippines in Angono, Rizal. References External links 
Philippine Standard Geographic Code Philippine Census Information Local Governance Performance Management System https colon slash slash web dot archive dot org slash web slash two oh one three one oh two nine one nine five two one nine slash http colon slash slash w dot tourism dot gov dot ph slash site pages slash festivities list ASPX festivity code equals two hundred five and month code equals oh four